Good morning, lads. It's Wednesday, and I'm Abby Lorbecki. And I'm Dylan Ham, and this is your KWHS News. College visits have started again, and the Counseling Center is busy. Chadron State College is here today, and you future hairdressers and cosmetologists, the Paul Mitchell reps will be here on Thursday, February 16th at lunch. If you are interested in the Culinary Arts School, Johnson & Wales will be here next week on February 21st. Rounding out the month of February is Lincoln Tech on February 28th. March visits kick off with the reps from UNC Greeley on the 8th. Remember to sign up at the Counseling Center for your help pass, and while you're there, check out important college-related information like scholarships and other upcoming school visits. Attention seniors, Senior Council is sponsoring a movie night on Friday, February 17th. Entry to the movie is free, but there will be food for sale. Bring your friends for a fun night and remember to vote for Pedro. Best of luck to our jazz band who will be competing today, tomorrow, and Friday at CU Boulder in the Mile High Jazz Festival. Bring back some hardware. Hey Abby, I'm a little hungry and it's not even lunch yet. Want to know what we're having for lunch today? Yeah, let's check in with Miss Betsy. Hey Miss Betsy, what's for lunch? Happy Wednesday! We're having chicken pot pie today and tomorrow meatball sub. So come on down and see us. Thanks and have a great day. Bye. Thanks, Miss Betsy. Remember to help Miss Betsy by paying your lunch charges or adding money to your accounts. Now here is Elijah Clark with our sports update. Good Wednesday morning, Glads. I'm Elijah Clark with your Gladiator Sports Update. Our basketball teams play TCI on Tuesday night, and the results are in. Our Lady Glads fought a hard battle, but dropped a game to the Lady Titans. The Glads fought to the buzzer, but lost to the Titans. If you haven't caught our basketball teams in action yet, their last regular season game is tomorrow. Come check out our teams as they take on Canyon City. The boys are at home, and the ladies are on the road at 7 p.m. CeCe's Pizza on Platte Avenue is a place to be this Friday, February 17th. Come out and support the Whitefield Baseball Team's fundraiser. Remember to give your receipt to the guest greeter. Glads, if you plan to play a spring sport, remember those practices begin on February 27th, and you must have a yellow card and current physical on file to participate. Stop by the main office to see Ms. Price to pick up your yellow card or physical pack. Finally, we have five wrestlers going to the state tournament in Denver this weekend. Best of luck to them as they battle for coveted state title. If you can make it up to the Pepsi Center, they would appreciate your support. That's all I have for you today. I'm Elijah Clark. Have a great Wednesday. Back to you, Abby and Dylan. Thanks, Elijah. Attention NJROTC cadets. The military ball is this Saturday from 6 to 11 p.m. You should have completed your paperwork to get on the entrance at the Peterson Air Force Base gate. You will need your driver's license and student ID at the, at the gate to enter the ball. Ladies, there is still some time to get a free dress for the military ball from Becca's closet. Contact Ms. Molina in room 111 or, or Ms. HK in the library for an appointment and check out those dresses at lunch, on green days, or during your study hall. If you have a dress you want to donate to Becca's Closet, please contact Ms. Molina or Ms. HK. Finally, it's not too early to start planning your prom experience. Start by getting your outside guest pass early to ensure your date can accompany you at the biggest dance of the year. Guest passes are due back on April 14th. The prom itself will be on April 22nd. Thanks for your attention. That's our news for today. I'm Abby Lorbecki. And I'm Dylan Hamm. And this was your KWHS News.